Frank Bukema Reads from the Diary of Thoughts, Volume 1. Poem written by Portuguese writer Jose Reggio, translated to English by Carlos Pacheco. Excerpts from the Diary of Thoughts, Volume 1. Epilogue. I always considered that I'm not better or worse than anybody else. But I always refused to participate in that pyramid of human behavior that human beings created for themselves, trying to impose those same fears and doubts by the most illogical ways, and simply expressing that they fear the strongest ones and punish those who didn't deserve it in the first place. If I would do that, I would be contradicting the final purpose of the Creator, His final message which is to evolve under the basis of understanding. This only means that we have to accept each other, with our differences, with our multiple states of mind, being these ones conditioned by our spirits, our souls, all this translated by our attitudes and behaviors. But never forgetting that the intelligent ones will be always the key, the final answer to our evolution and collective comfort as a whole. Finally, the main purpose of life herself. Duality and ambiguity are existing definitions that express conflicts and contradictions. All those elements together are nothing more than the necessary elements to achieve final conclusions, to understand about our existence, finally, to comprehend life and her creator. As a brief example, I can say to you that one day my wife gave me a poem of the Portuguese poet José Reggio that matches in an intrinsically way who I am, what I represent, and mostly matches those two words through the ones I assume my road, my dignity, and my pride. Finally, my posture in life that I completely recognize and admit. Black Canticle Come this way, they tell me with sweet eyes, giving me their arms and being sure that would be good that I would listen to them when they say, come this way. I look at them with empty eyes. There's irony and tiredness in my eyes. I cross my arms and I never go that way. My glory is that one, to create inhumanity, to be with no one, because I live with no will that made me born through the gap in my mother's legs. No, I don't go that way. I only go where my steps will lead me. If to all my questions, nobody will answer, why do you keep telling me Come this way. I'd rather slide on muddy corners, be taken by the wildest winds, to crawl on my bloody feet, than go that way. If I came to this world, was just to explore virgin forests, to design my steps on the desert sand, the rest that I do means nothing. How come it would be you that would give me the will, the tools, and the courage to overcome my obstacles and doubts. It runs in your veins, the old blood of your ancestors. You love what is easy. I love the far away and the mirage. I love the cliffs, the rivers, and the deserts. Go ahead. You have roads. You have gardens and flowers. You have countries and houses. You have rules, treaties, philosophers, and scientists. I have my madness. I will raise it like a torch, burning in the dark of night, and I feel foam, blood, and canticles on my lips. God and evil guide me, nobody else. Everyone had a father and a mother, but I, that never have begun, and will never end. I was born from the love between God and evil. Oh, nobody give me merciless intentions. 
Nobody asks me for definitions. Nobody say to me, come this way. My life is a storm on the loose. It's a new wave on the sea. It's a single particle on the universe. I don't know where I go. I don't know where to go. But I know that I don't go that way.